What if one man quietly solved puzzles so deep? Even the greatest mathematicians struggled to comprehend them? A man who connected ancient Indian brilliance to the forefront of modern mathematics, and yet, barely anyone knows his name. This is the story of Shankar Abhankar, the forgotten genius who reshaped algebraic geometry and left behind a legacy as profound as it is invisible. The story begins in 1941, in the vibrant city of India. While the world was at war, a quiet boy sat cross-legged under the warm sun, his mind wandering beyond what eyes could see. While other children memorized tables, young Shankar was fascinated by patterns, patterns in numbers, in stars, in the rhythms of Sanskrit verses. He didn't just solve problems, he wanted to know why they worked. That curiosity would shape everything. He grew up in an India that was awakening, a land throwing off the chains of colonialism and daring to dream of its own future. And in that moment of rebirth, Shankar Abhankar dreamed not of politics or power, but of pure mathematics. By the time he reached university, it was clear his mind was different. At the University of Bombay, and later at Harvard University, Shankar devoured mathematics at a staggering pace. His passion? Algebraic geometry, a field that blends shapes and equations, where lines and curves become the language of the infinite. But he didn't just study it, he expanded it. At Harvard, surrounded by the world's brightest minds, this quiet Indian mathematician stunned his professors. He solved problems they had debated for decades. He proposed new ideas, daring, elegant, and profoundly original. His doctoral thesis on ramification theory and resolution of singularities was so advanced, it reshaped the landscape of algebraic geometry. While others sought fame, Shankar sought truth. In the coming decades, Shankar's name became legendary in select circles, but only among mathematicians who could even understand his work. He published groundbreaking papers on resolution of singularities in characteristic, the abhankar mo theorem, algebraic surfaces, and local fields. Each paper was like a key unlocking another door inside the hidden palace of mathematics. But fame, he never cared, while others built empires of prestige. Shankar worked late nights in silent classrooms, at chalkboard and his thoughts, his only audience. He once said, mathematics is not a profession. It is a passion, a fire, either it burns in you, or it doesn't. In the 1960s, Shankar moved to the United States. At Purdue University, he became a professor, not just teaching, but inspiring. Generations of students sat in awe as he unraveled the deepest knots of algebraic geometry with a calm, almost meditative clarity. To his students, he was more than a teacher, he was a guide through the infinite. Yet outside of academia, his name barely echoed. He never courted headlines, he never sought prizes. And in a world obsessed with fame, his brilliance went unnoticed by the masses. But his work quietly transformed modern mathematics. Today, his theorems power the foundations of algebraic geometry, which in turn fuels everything from cryptography to coding theory, from robotics to modern physics. Shankar worked until his final days, still exploring, still curious, still chasing patterns only he could see. In 2012, he passed away. There were no front page obituaries, no breaking news, just silence. But to the mathematicians who knew, his death was the fading of a star. Shankar Abhankar was not loud, he was not famous, but he was immortal in the only way that matters, through the truths he uncovered. And that is why stories like his must be told, because genius is not always celebrated, but it deserves to be remembered if this story moved you. If you believe hidden minds deserve their place in history, subscribe to this channel.